hope you're all well and safe. I wanted to make a video about my experience with the Ordinary products. A couple months ago I was not taking care of my skin like we all should and honestly like I, I, I thought it was gonna be a trend. Everyone was talking about the Ordinary products as if it was like super super good and super efficient after almost six months using them every single day I want to give my opinion about every product that I have so the first thing I'm going to recommend is to just do research about every single product so what I did was go to the website and start reading every product, how it's gonna help your skin. So what I love about the website is that there is a section where you can look through your type of skin. For example, mine is normal to dry. I was experiencing some dryness and I, I popped pimples uh, in a wrong way and it left a scar. That was very red and it was not going away. So I, I thought that it was time for for me to just take a little bit more care and take more time to take care of my skin. So I'm going to tell you the routine that I do in the morning and at night. So the first thing I got is the Marine Hyaluronics. Uh, this is a new product. They used to have the, the normal hyaluronic. It exfoliates. It's very watery. Very, very light. So you got to be fast applying it. What my recommendation is, is to put it straight into your face and go fast because it evaporates so fast. I don't know if evaporates is the word, but you know what I mean, like it just disappears so fast. I highly recommend the Marine Hyaluronics for exfoliation. I start with this in the morning after I wash my face with just water. I apply the Marine Hyaluronics and after the Marine Hyaluronics, I apply the Nice Cinnamon. So basically this is a little bit more heavy. It feels heavier, but when you apply it, it's super smooth and it just it goes so so well. It feels so good on my skin. I, I know I, I'm, I'm always saying that but it, it really does. This is helping so much with my scars. The redness is gone and they're healing slowly but it's very very good. I can't recommend this enough. After the Nine Cinnamon and Sink, I apply the moisturizer. This moisturizer, it's so good. It makes your face feel so fresh all the time. Obviously, I don't know what I'm talking about, I have no idea about skincare, but it actually feels really, really good. The last part of my skincare routine in the morning is the SPF. I've been using this SPF for years. This is a very important step of your routine. Without the SPF, everything that you just did, nothing is gonna work. Because the most important thing is protecting yourself from the sun and the UV rays. Some products have a lot of, let's say, acid, I don't know how to explain it, that can burn your skin if it's exposed to the sun. So it's very important that you protect yourself. With SPF, every single day, even though you're not going to the street, even though you're inside your house, wear SPF because you can have a window open and you can just go there and like take the trash out and you don't realize that those couple of minutes that you're out in the street, it can just mess up with your skin. After my morning routine, I go and start my makeup routine. I'm not gonna show my makeup routine. What I'm gonna talk about is the Ordinary Foundation. So this is a serum. So it's very, very important that you shake before you use it. It has a lot, a lot of tones. So you have a lot of options. I'm using the Lightweight Serum Formula. This is amazing. I just use like two pumps and it just covers my entire face. I am wearing it right now. So easy to apply and it lasts the entire day. I highly recommend the foundation. Like I said before, I'm using the lightweight formula. I don't know how the other formulas from The Ordinary work, but this one is the one that I tried and I've been wearing this for almost four months because I didn't buy this with the other product. But the combination of my skincare routine with my makeup routine it just goes so well with everything so that's for my morning routine and then at night I have a different routine whenever I come home from work obviously I have to take my makeup off so my night routine starts with this cleanser so this is La Roche-Posay micellar foaming water I like a very soft and lightweight cleanser I don't use uh, makeup wipes I think those are horrible to your skin and to the environment I think that the most important thing to take in consideration when it comes to cleansers, from my experience, is to just feel fresh and 
not to have your skin burning or red or just feeling uncomfortable after you take your makeup off. If your skin is feeling kind of weird after your cleanser, I think you should change it. I have no idea what I'm talking about, but it, this is from my experience. After taking my makeup off, I go with the Marine Hyaluronics again to exfoliate a little bit and it just feels nice. Like I said, it just feels fresh. After the Marine Hyaluronics, obviously after the exfoliation, I think that it's very important to go to sleep with some kind of hydration. I don't use a moisturizer before I go to sleep, but I use the 100% plant derived Squalane. This is very, very oily. Sometimes it's extremely oily, so it's very, very important that you just use two or three drops. What I don't like about this product is that it doesn't incorporate very good on my skin, so I still have my face kind of oily throughout the night. It happens in my face because I have a friend that is using it at the moment, and that doesn't happen to her, so for me, it just it takes a little bit longer than normal for this product to get fully on my skin. But when I wake up the next day, I'm perfectly fine, like I have no oil whatsoever. This helps with dehydration and I recommend it. But like I said, if you don't like feeling oily, uh, you gotta be careful. So that is my morning and night routine. Um, I hope that helps and I really hope that you guys try the Ordinary products, I cannot recommend that enough. And they're cheaper than the normal products. Currently it's less than $20 each product. You have two different sizes for some products, the 60ml or the 30ml. The most important thing that you need to take in consideration is that if you're applying it straight to your face, do not touch your skin with the, with the tube thing. Because your face has a lot of bacteria and it can just go inside the product. I recommend it 100%. I feel amazing. My face is so much healthier. So just research about what you need for your type of skin and just go for it. It's been six months already and I'm super happy with it and I'm not changing my routine for now. So yeah, hope this helps and I hope that you try these products because they're amazing. All right, thank you for watching and I hope you have a great day or a great night wherever you are and that you stay safe. Just be happy and thankful. All right, bye.